I thought that it was a meet. I didn't know that I was gonna have to read. And then the casting director, who I know, doesn't even acknowledge me. She just walks right by without saying a word. And then she says they want to put me on tape. And I'm like, excuse me, but you need special makeup for that. Or you look green. And she says, well, you can either tape or not. Like, it's all some pointless exercise. And I just can't take it anymore, Jacob. I'm so tired and it's so pathetic. Your mother, of course, was Clarice Taggart, the wonderful actress who died tragically in a fire. What is it like starring in a remake of a movie and essentially playing your mother? Scary. You can be an actor, Rick, not a TV cowboy. You're better than that. <laughs> Dwine. Cut! You embarrass yourself like that in front of all those goddamn people. <laughs> All right, what's the matter, partner? It's official, old buddy. Well, it has been. Please don't go to sleep now. No, 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 leave the other one. Zing, zing, zing. The kids need a home, Judy. I know what kids need. They need their mother. You can't have the world's greatest entertainer out here without a drink. Frank Sinatra's here? Frank is great, but he is no Judy Garland. I don't have a home. I can't even get a manager. London would offer you a lot of money. Talk of the town is desperate to do a deal with you. You're saying I have to leave my children if I want to make enough money to be with my children? Oh, dang. What's I wonder if you can guess who I am. I'm Baby Jane Hudson. Who the hell was Baby Jane Hudson? I've written a letter to Daddy saying I love you. How did we end up here? This place is horrible. Smells like balls. We had it all. You were a movie star, remember? Who was this guy? He used to be Birdman. I like that poster. You wrote this adaptation? I did, yeah. And you're directing and starring in your I, adaptation. That's yeah. ambitious. Are you afraid people will say you're doing this play to battle the impression that you're a washed up comic strip character? Absolutely not. That's why 20 years ago I said no to Birdman. Makes you the girl next door. <laughs> What's her name? Gloria Graham. Big name in black and white films. Never heard of her. Won an Oscar too, if memory serves. Big fans of Gloria, we were. Me and your mum. Is this like a date or? Okay. What kind of a person hangs out in a joint where you're labeled on the lampshade anyway? Make it Suntory time. Gato, 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 gato! Time is not enough. Your passion, camera, tension, raise it. Ah, with intensity. Is that everything? I mean, it seemed like you said more than that. Mister Bob Hollis. You are a guitar now, Bob. You are a movie star. Yes, I should be doing movies. Yeah. You know, Rat Pack. Rat. Rat Pack. Rat Pack. A ring a ding ding. Don't get up. And please stop acting as if I were the queen mother. Sorry, I didn't Outside know. of a beehive, Margot, your behavior would hardly be considered either queenly or motherly. You're in a beehive, pal, didn't you know? We're all busy little bees, full of stings, making honey day and night. Because this is a Hollywood story about the people who make the movies. The little ones that you never hear of, like Betty and me. The great ones, like Cecil B. DeMille. All those who knew Norma Desmond. A strange woman who left her mark on all of us, who crossed her path. Has it ever occurred to you that I may have a life of my own, that there, there may be some girl that I'm crazy about? Who? Some car hop or a dress extra? What I'm trying to say is that I'm all wrong for you. You want a Valentino, somebody with polo ponies, a big shot. What you're trying to say is you don't want me to love you. Say it. Say it. Licht und Schatten, das sind die beiden Geheimnisse des Films. Sie dürfen Veronika zu mir sagen. Ist es schön? Ja. Wenn du trinkst, mich aufzubauen, 
Nicht groß, schön, dafür Arsch. <lacht>